Two more things about these cameras to know about is where the SD cards and the batteries are on these devices. So with these cameras, the batteries and the SD cards are in the same spot. So I'll just show you on this one. It's a little bit easier, a little bit lighter. So when you open it up, we have the slot right here for the SD card. So you slide that up. There's two of them. It'll tell you where you are filming whenever you turn on the camera. So make sure when you put the SD card back in, you slide this down because it won't allow you to record. The batteries on the underside of the of the camera. So to remove the battery, you, there's this release here that you do press it down, and then the cam the battery will just swipe up. And then when you put it in, super simple. So the charger for the batteries looks like this. So when you put the battery, when you take the battery out, you want to slide away, slide down, so that you can take it out. And then when you want to enter it. You should be able to place it in and then slide it forward and then it'll click and then when it's charging the charge button will light up and it'll be able to charge. On the M50s the battery and the SD card are in the same spot as the camera is on the underside here. There's this switch that you do so you just press down slide it forward it'll pop open. The SD card lives here. You just take that out put that back in and then the battery there's this little lever to take it out take it out you'll be able to put it back in. The charger for the battery looks like this. So when you take it out, there are two arrows here that'll help you connect it. The two arrows need to be you know, facing the same way and touching each other nearly for them to be able to charge. So when you take it out, just press the bottom back and it'll come out. When you slide it in, top part down, and then click it in. Again, the charge button will light up when you have it in the right spot to charge. With the R100s, and the T6i, they share the same battery, they use the same battery, so, and their chargers look like this, similar to what the, R, um, the M50s look like. A lot of the Canon uh, batteries for, and their chargers for the Canon cameras look all the same for the mirrorless and DSLR cameras. So, same way, the arrows need to be facing the same way and touching. Slide it out, slide it in, the light will pop up if you, turn, if you plug it in the right way. So with the R100 is very similar to the M50. Instead, there's just this little switch, open it up. SD card lives on the bottom here again. And then there's this switch here to open up the battery and take it out. Make sure that when we are closing it that you have to slide it back. The camera will not turn on if you don't have this secured. With the T6i, the SD card lives on the side of the camera here. So you just, uh, there's the little note, it'll tell you where it is. There's these grips, Sl uh, push away from the camera, it'll open it up, press the SD card out, put it back in. And then the battery is on the underside. Again, this one is a little bit different. There's this little switch here that you need to try to use your nails or your finger to open it up, slide it up, and then the battery is there. Just like that. Again, try to make sure you hear click and close. The camera will turn on unless you're able to do that. So that is the T6i where the battery is and the SD card. Now the T7s are similar to the M50s where the battery and the SD card live in the same spot. So this is just like the T6i, there's this little thing you open up, SD card is here, and the battery is here. Again, similar to all the other cameras, you need to make sure that this one doesn't have where the arrows are to tell you. You just need to look in where you see these prongs, make sure that the battery lines up with that, and it'll lock in. Make sure that when you plug it in, if you see the charge light turning on, it means you put it in the right way, and you can, and the battery will charge. And all of these cha camera chargers live in the cabinet, the metal cabinet by my desk that has all the stickers on it.